to the fourth annual Latino Corporate Directors Association Board Leaders Convening. We're trying to change the governance landscape by having more Latinos on corporate boards. Our organization represents fabulously qualified, insightful, articulate business professionals from every industry and sector, including technology. So how do we advance our mission? We advance our mission by increasing supply, increasing demand, and raising awareness. This is a really important organization, and we need to show up at the very beginning and to help plant the seeds so that other companies can see how important it is to support organizations like the LCDA. You're not just meeting in a room to talk about the problem. You're really proposing practical solutions. You're helping credential directors. We've got qualified candidates. We just need to look at the people in this room. So that is no longer an excuse. The best bet for the U.S. being able to ensure we can maintain some semblance of fiscal balance is to be as tied as possible to the productive capacity of Hispanics and Latinos and the demographic profile of the Hispanic Latino population, which is productive, aspirational, younger, powering economic as well as cultural activity. 74% of the workforce in the future will be by Latinos. There's a lot of activists out there that put forward a lot of strong and highly qualified directors, and they will be more likely to win if they have qualified LCDA directors on board. It's important for us to broaden our network. That's why I'm here selfishly today, to broaden our network for, for when we join these governance committees. We want different ethnic backgrounds. We want to increase diversity clearly. We also want relevant industry experience. What does this person bring in terms of ability to drive performance and change in a board? And that's where we feel most comfortable in adding a Latino, not because he's a Latino, but because of what he brings to the table. We want to have better connections with the Latin American business community. We've added one person to a KKR board from this connection, and we're just getting started. We have a goal for our U.S. companies that we're going to have 80% or more of our boards have two or more diverse directors by the end of this year. The makeup of new board members this year, that's where we are succeeding the fastest. 76% of the new directors we're first-time directors. We are in a wave of change here, and it's a change that we all need to come together to figure out how do we make sure that Latinos ride that wave in a positive way.